Don't you guys think this is a little bit Oh, cool? come on. She deserves it. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. No! Shut First off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget. For, for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Son of a bitch. So I got moved to the back and next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh yeah? That feels the same to me. Up here, it probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, I, I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, oh, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey guys, get up here okay? Yeah, well, more or less, but it's so good to see you. What's up with him? Yo, yo, we get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. So Matt and Emily are a thing now, right? Yeah, so it seems. I mean, what's Mike think of that? I have a feeling Mike's already got his hands full, you know what I mean? Huh. Damn it, it's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in, they're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like, get open or something. Wait a second, are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. You doing all right? Yeah, aside from being kind of cold and vaguely creeped out by this place. It's, it's kind of weird being back up here, huh? Yeah. Matt, been a while. Rough season, huh? Yeah, something like that. So, uh, you and Emily, that happening? <laughs> Define happening. You know, like together? I mean, it's happening, but I'm, I'm not really sure what it is. Yet? Um, yeah. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. How's, uh, how's she doing? She's fine. Why? No reason.
Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? Now I just want to rip that parka right off of her and make some snow angels, right? No. Absolutely. When are you going to take her to the bone zone? <laughs> like that could ever happen. Come on, man. She practically spends her entire life with you as it is. Well, yeah, but we're like friends. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Maybe you're right. You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. Jeez. So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Cochise, or else you got four lovely ladies who are gonna be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, shoot. Nobody likes cool buns. Hmm. Damn, I'm getting pretty low in juice here. I just had to turn off my GPS. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. more attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa. Did I do that? I, I don't think so. Here, use this. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What, what is it? Okay, so... I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant gonna help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I gotcha. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye-bye frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm going to go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim.
here. How was that? How'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be, like, getting the lock open or something? On it.
perfect. We're freezing our buns off out here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. Ah! <laughs> Crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I'd use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Make yourself at home, bro. We'll do. Yeah, come on in. Take a load off, have whatever you want. You just take whatever you want anyway, right? Whoa, easy there, cowboy. Mike, stay away from our girlfriend. Dude, what are you talking about? Stay away from Emily. Emily? Why would I want anything to do with Emily? Quit being such a dick, man. Nobody wants you here. Seriously, what's your problem, meathead? You son of a bitch! Hey, hey, get off me! Hey! What the hell is wrong with you two? We didn't come back here just to tear each other's heads off. I mean, we came back here to have a good time, right? Hey, Mike, why don't you and Jess go check out the guest cabin I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, cool. Want to head up there? Sure. So, Josh, uh, should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the, the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my God, don't you remember? Next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, Do I, you? I guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. And then we can get warm? We can get very warm. Okay. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. <sighs> Exiled. Sexiled. <laughs> Works for me. Ugh, burr. How far is this cabin anyway. This cabin is the coziest, most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars. You're gonna need these. Porn star? I'd pay to see you. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No.
Now, that's something I can help you with. And how are you gonna do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind. Not a lot of TLC for this place anymore. Kind of a bummer. muscle flexing back there with you and Matt. What a dick, right? Dude has no business coming at me like that. He's got any brain. And that huge dumb melon, he better find it and use it or he's gonna get wrecked. Wow, nasty Mikey. Just riled up. Me likey. Huh. Guess this thing needs juice or something. Didn't Josh say there was a generator? Hey, Mike. Gonna find the generator or what? All right. Let's see. Boom. Nice one, Mikey. Woo! You are a wizard. Sam, the gates shall open. Pretty good, right? Yeah, totally. That was just awesome. Oh, yeah. I bring the hits. <laughs> you psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure, a sexcapade. Wow. Police tape. From Hannah and Beth. I think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. It's all such a blur. I can barely even remember what happened. Well, what I remember is that we played a stupid half-baked prank that probably got Hannah and Beth killed. Hey, I mean, it's not our fault they ran into the woods. Yeah. How could anyone have expected them to do a dumb thing like that?
Dang it. I don't think we can get her to the cabin with a path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, a.k.a. Wax Museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. You know what? Fuck it. We're adventuring. Ah! Ah! Jess! Fuck. Hey, Jessica! Yep. Hey. I'm okay. Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Can you get out? I... I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. All right, Jess, there's a cart. I think if you can push it, you can get by. All right. Okay, let me just try. <laughs> It's too heavy. All right, try it again. It's super heavy. But maybe you already loosened it a bit. Hey, Michael. I'm, like, pretty ripped at all, but I don't think I can move it. Any other bright ideas? Hey, so, babe, you see the little gap down there? Between the cart and the wall? The tiny little gap? Yeah, maybe you can just, you know, like shimmy through it or something. <laughs> I appreciate your confidence in my physique, but I don't think the ladies are gonna fit. Oh, with, the, right, okay, gotcha. Okay, so, why don't you either toss that light down or, you know, be a hero and jump down here to assist me? All right, Jess, I'm gonna drop the light down, okay? Look alive. What? Look al All right, just a heads up. Get it? Yeah, yeah, I got it. <sighs> Something. A bat? All right, coming after you. Just stay put. My bats have rabies. Well, it's not gonna bite you. Okay, that's what bats do. They bite me. Not the good kind of willies. Can I offer you a little comfort and reassurance? <laughs> we'll save it for the cabin, Buster.
Beer pit stay. Smoke cigars. <laughs> it's recent. I wonder who's up here. Whoa. This place is like historical. Holy bat cave. It's gotta be Native American, right? I don't think the miners were getting their arts and crafts on, no. <laughs> no, no, it's like a shrine or something. A shrine to what? Fixer rubber. Josh said cabin, I felt like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Uh, I'm gonna take a ride on Air Force One. <laughs> all right, all right. Save it for this dumb speech, buddy. Ooh, a telescope! Gonna look at the trees, gonna look at the clouds, gonna look at the cabin. Uh, whoa. You all right? I just saw someone at the cabin. Okay. <laughs> Let me see. Oh. 
sampling the old eggnog again, babe? It's just us up here. Um, maybe. Hey, Jess. Mm-hmm? Stay close by, okay? What's up? Uh, this posting says there's some brown bears up here sometimes. Oh. Michael, I have the best idea. What? Let's go hug a bear. Come on, please. Come on. Let's not hug a bear. <laughs> Stuff. She's so gross! Like diseases and shit! Josh, couldn't you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here? <laughs> really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half-empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. <laughs> oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. Ah! Boo! Okay. Okay. That's how it's gonna be. Yes? <coughs> yes! Sammy! What? You wanna help me get this fire going? Uh, well, I was just getting into the bath. Oh. Oh, do you need any help with that? Hardy are. Come on. All right, Josh, let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge.
brush much. sure that somewhere in this crazy place we used to have a spirit board. A what? Wow, you have a spirit board? Those things are a joke, man. They don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time. Me and... Well... Hey Josh, no hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Well, yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um, okay. Guess so. Brad, I mean, you're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? messages.
notice how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together? Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. And I just wish Chris would go for it. He's so paralyzed, thinking she's gonna shoot him down. It's not gonna happen. Which thing? Well, neither, if he doesn't go for it, which, knowing Chris, he won't unless someone's holding a gun to his head. <laughs> You know, Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say. Uh, what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and you know that you came, Sam. I'll, look, I'll be honest. It's definitely weird being back here, but. I think it'll help us all put everything behind us. Um, I want us to have a good time, you know? Hey, watch your step. I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. Sorry to drag you down into the bowels. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. doing here. Is that yours? You bet it's mine. I used to play ball with my dad all the time. Of course, that was before he got too busy to hang out with me. Ah, well, save it for the couch, right? Okay, let me see what I can do with this old hot water machine. Hold this. What was that? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. Hey, can you just keep the light so I can see, okay? Sam, please. Nice one. Okay, first things first, we gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mmm, sounds kinda complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Damn. 
It's okay. I'm just try again. about to burst or some problem with the furnace. Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you... are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master! Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank. Which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared, admit it. I was not! Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh! What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. All right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay.
I would like to understand your feeling toward people who fear failure and worry about what others think of them. Do you share this fear? <laughs> How do you feel about people who are afraid? I see, well, Emily has quite a fear of failure. Do you feel bad for her? Indeed, that is apparent from the choices you made. investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? Yeah. So, you would tell the truth even if it resulted in an unpleasant outcome for a friend. And what about honesty then, and charity? Such a giving and caring person. Very nice. Oh, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon.